So it looks like it's a slow season, which I can see there's a bunch of them. They usually get a lot bigger than this. They're usually a lot bigger, and there's usually a lot more. So the weather's been kind of weird. So it ain't really produced this year. Actually look like there's been a bunch of them that died through here. Oh, as you can see, some of these stalks get pretty big on them. This is probably a four or five year old one, which they start producing one to three years old. So you could buy a baby one and uh, it'll probably produce that next following year, a year or two. So yeah, look at all of them. Let's go over here a little. This is about the normal size of them. Which they usually make hundreds and hundreds of them. Now here's a little mature tree. You can see there's an abundance of uh, fruit on them. So yeah. Look at that all through there. A lot of these haven't ripened yet. But yeah. These um... This is wild plum here. Check out the bark. And, uh, they grow all around Texas here. And they produce, I think, twice a year. So, yeah, I'm going to try to pick some of these right here. And then uh, we'll see what we wind up with, which I don't think it's going to be much. Because most of these ain't right. But, yeah, I just wanted to show the. Uh, Texas wild plum. Like I said, there's a red and a yellow variety. They ripen to yellow. I'm trying to get a picture of the uh, leaves. So I just wanted to show what they look like.